Hello friend, this is Fio M11 Plus Limited Edition High Res Audio Dab uh, from Fio with support MQA, DST and all and also it supports Qualcomm Aptex, Qualcomm Aptex ST, Double IC from Apple and let's see what is there inside the box and how it works and what are the features it has and it's a very nice uh, dab from Fio, it's very popular limited edition you can see the packaging it's, uh, is very nice uh, like Apple packaging and inside the box we have your M11 Plus tab it seems first impression seems very heavy and it comes with uh, one leather cover leather style cover and uh, also a one tempered glass uh, we'll check it later and uh, let's see what else inside the box and the size if you um, check it's a 6 inch iPhone the right hand side and left hand side 5.5 inch Fio so difference is not much and we have in the box uh, memory card ejector tool and some booklets uh, user guides and uh, warranty card information so apart from that we have another small box which has uh, one charging cable let's see what else a very good quality charging cable and one 3.52 rca connector and this is fioda 5.5 inch uh, display and let me take out its cover so that we can check what else so this cover is very nice one and the button you can see it's a honeycomb style button it's a power button volume rockers in the light right hand side we have play and pause button and the next previous button also a music mode and memory card slot and behind you can see some diamond cut style design it's a plain uh, flat design but it looks like a diamond cuts and and in the front side we have 5.5 inch display with tempered glass so design wise it's very nice but little heavy you can see and let me switch on that okay so it features snapdragon 660 octagon processor 6000 mh battery and limited edition which is ak4497 dac it has two dac and two amplifier a triple a amplifier thx and uh, it's bezel-less design you can see and in the wallpaper itself it's showing two dac is there and including two amplifier and Qualcomm Snapdragon processor and the uh, Aptex ST. Fio Music 3 is installed, pre installed in it. So, if you want to play some local music, you can play. And it's very snappy design. And Android, it's running on Android 10. And in the left side, volume, it's a uh, a touch panel volume control you can increase and decrease like this also it's a button work as a button okay so it's a very cool design but accidentally you maybe increase or decrease sometime okay you can turn off that also yeah it has also usb DAC mode you can connect to a laptop and listen the music and i connected and tested it uh, by installing one driver fio driver and if you check uh, in speakers you will find fio m series then if you go to more settings then uh, we can see the uh, frequency settings like 32 bit 384 kilohertz studio quality it supports you can directly play with that in a laptops and fio has another feature which i like the most is uh, fio link you have to download the Fio music app in your mobile so in the settings you will find Fio link in the DAV also in the settings uh, Fio link in the mobile itself so you have to turn on the server then you will see the IP address and then same IP address you have to put in the mobile Fio music mobile then the Fio music will be linked in the Fio DAV so you can change the music you can play and pause the music from your mobile itself you need not to always pick the DAP. So uh, let me give you an example. I am playing one music over here. So you can see the same music is played in a mobile. So if you click on next, the DAP also changing. 
the music on the tap and uh, I played here in the mobile and there also it's changing so 96 or 24 bit file is there so in this way you can link a few music mobile to DAP and uh, after that I tried to play uh, wirelessly with uh, Sony XM3 and uh, the Bluetooth connection uh, was fast it was not slow so immediately it connected to the DAP so you can see and uh, also it uh, automatically figured out the uh, Bluetooth codec that is LDAC so you can see LDAC is shown over here and Sony's own headphone connect app also worked fine over here and uh, the sound quality I would say it's a flat and balanced sound signature no muddy bass in the XM3 and the best wireless sound I have ever heard in any of the DAP so wirelessly it's working perfect and I have tested with Hi-Fi and Sundra and I have Fio FH7 with balance cable so this is Fio FH7 uh, IEM so previously I was using Fio Q Q3 with my iPhone and also I was uh, uh, later I tried with Fio this tab M11 plus M LTD so I'll tell the difference what I found so in Q3 it's a very detailed sound but it not that smooth but in this dab M11 plus tab so it's a very clean and clear and very smooth sound I found but uh, it's uh, only in high gain not in low gain low gain I think it's a very low power in this tab so I use this connector 3.5 to 3.5 I will use this as a line out so in 3.5 you can connect this and the other end I will connect with Q3 uh, that has also a THX amplifier so that I can produce more power in it and there are more settings like line out and PO settings so in line out what happens uh, it's uh, a high gain with full volume so that uh, it will go to the amplifier and it will produce more power okay so there are more different uh, modes like you can see android mode pure music mode usb tag mode bluetooth airplay for apples apple music and this mode you can select so other than that uh, you will see also you here you can set the line out and PO uh, in 4.5 in also 3.5 both thing you can use 4.5 mm balance output it has also 2.5 mm balance output both balance output is there in this tab and I was using high gain because low medium is doesn't sound good high gain you will get more power also all to DST you can convert also here you can set the high gain low gain in the quick menu also so let me connect the other end to Fio Q3 DAC which has also THX amplifier I will use 3.5 mm port as input of this amplifier and 2.5 mm balance as output you can see And with this setup you can play high impedance uh, headphones uh, also I was using this Hi-Fi Man Sundra and it produced much more power and uh, good quality sound sound will not change because the external uh, DAC will add, act as an amplifier and uh, I, I increase little bit of volume and put here so little bit of volume you will get enough power to run this Hi-Fi Man Sundra so if you directly run the uh, headphone by this tab you will get much smooth sound cleaner sound but not that much power but it is good for any IEM low impedance IEM this tab is very nice for that and if I'll talk about the sound quality it is way too good better than Q3 you will get clean and smooth sound but uh, separation sometimes I find uh, it's not that great but uh, it's okay and it is THX amplifier which will not add any colors to the sound it will you'll get exact same output and uh, if you run high quality audio also like FLAC 
DST and MK, you will get better result. And this Fio Music, uh, I got a software update, but I tried to install it, but it uh, didn't work. I don't know why. But this Fio Music works very good in this uh, DAP. Any kind of uh, music file you can play with this Fio, and uh, this Fio Music is uh, best supported application for this DAP. And I use Apple Music also. But uh, obviously Android will compress this frequency from the Apple Music but Fio Music works better here in this tab. And uh, if you check the YouTube also I found some issues in YouTube, audio video doesn't sync in this. Like then after update uh, and it is running fine now but initially I figured out that the audio and the video was not sync in the YouTube application in this uh, tab. So for audio it's good, for video I will suggest it's not good because the pixel is not that great in this. And that's all about this device, thanks for watching.